What's going on Spartans? Welcome back. Today we're doing three stars on Town Hall 9. So it will not be me attacking. It'll be a lot of other people doing some very well done attacks with different forces. So if you want to see how to use different forces to three star a Town Hall 9, this will help you in war. And hopefully the rest of my clan will learn from this because some guys are having trouble with it. And I think this will help a lot because these are very well done attacks for the most part. And of course, you can see these are pretty leveled up Town Hall 9s. At least this one is for sure. And you can see we're working our way into the middle here. And he is going to kill it. Now, Valentin is actually a very good attacker. He does 3 stars pretty much every time he walks into a, a Town Hall 9. Which is very good and very helpful in war. Now you can see 45%. He's going to get that first star very shortly here. And he's super confident. He only saved 6 archers for that Town Hall. Which is awesome. And 55%. There's that one star. Cleaning up here. The golems are stuck on walls, unfortunately, which is really bad news. You really need those to stay free. But he actually doesn't need that one golem, luckily. These witches are doing a great job of staying in front of the cannons, which is good. Now, she is going to die, but still has some skeletons left. The golems are going to all go together into that center, which is interesting. The king and Pekka's taken out the town hall. That's the second star. Very well done. And here we go. The golems are into that. Ooh, a nice, nice. They got in that quadrant. And now they're going to extract all the guns. So super, super good news there. And the king is untouched so far, working his way around the outside. A skelly trap does come out. Um, not going to be much of an issue. These golems are still alive. And they're taking the heat. The Oh, my God. This is going to go really well here. You can see the wizards are taking the walls out. This is pretty much prime territory for what you want to happen. There are no big bombs to kill the wizards, which is awesome. And now the golems are still in front of everything. The king does start getting hit here, unfortunately. But he does kill the Tesla very quickly. Now there's only one archer tower left. And that archer tower is concentrated on the golem. So the wizards are going to take it out, no problemo. Still has his P.E.K.K.A.s. 300,000 elixir, 200,000 gold, so about 550,000 loot and 32 trophies. Very well done in gold. We are in a clan push, so a lot of our guys are pushing right now, and you're about to see that. That push did start yesterday morning, so most people are just starting their push out. But this guy, Scrappy, is using two Lava Hounds along with Belinion. So very, actually just Loons, he's not even using Minions. Wow, very risky, but very good. Let's see how this turns out. I know it's going to be a great raid. Here you go. And that second Lava Lunion is down. Or except Lava Hound. Wow, I said Lava Lunion. <laughs> the second Lava Hound is down, guys. And the balloons are still going. He still has a heal spell and a rage. The heal spell is down, protecting that group of balloons. So is that second heal. And the rage spell should be going down pretty shortly here. We shall see where he drops it. But he is going to drop his king and queen down there. The queen and king are down face off against the king you can barely see it sorry guys and oh my god there goes that rage it's power time guys and he's a very well placed rage too because it keeps it in the area of all those defenses look at those balloons go just absolutely wrecking everything over there and it is game over for this base guys there are a few air units there's two hogs and of course his heroes and things are going great the invis queen just did a little bit of work there put some archers out i'm surprised he didn't enrage his king yet but i guess he's just waiting but the balloons are killing it in this base. Still alive. They did split up, which is good news. I kind of wish they had split up more because it's very helpful when they spread out a lot. But that's okay. I actually sometimes save one balloon so I can drop it on the opposite side of the base. That's a little trick. It's risky, but it's very helpful for a three-star. Now, 100% on that one. Very well done. Another 500,000 loot and 14 trophies. Nice job in Crystal 3. Nice find up in Masters 2. A Town Hall 9 pretty well leveled up. He is using Belinion only with a king. That is all he's using. 31 loons, 32 loons, and of course 30 minions. A clan castle and only a level 10 king. There goes the double rage which is about to have that second rage spell drop. There it is. And he does have two heal spells which is really awesome. Uh, let's see how he uses them. I think that was a kind of poorly placed heal spell but that's okay. He uses the second one a lot better, and you're about to see that. 
And of course, that t level 10 king will get in there eventually. He's being very patient with that. The balloons and minions are clearing out this base, though. Look at this. It's unprotected in most areas. And, oh, there goes that heal spell. Very well done there. Definitely needed in front of that high-level wizard. That wizard can do a lot of damage to a group of loons. And, of course, it is all gone, though. So there's about one wizard left that could be trouble. And, of course, that air sweeper is definitely pushing those loons back a lot. But we have balloons on the opposite side, which are going to do just fine. And here we go. Taking out the expo. Once that's gone, it's going to be pretty much all hands on deck. And as you can see, these loons are going to kill the rest of the base without much of an issue. Still have minions left. Has an enraged king at level 10. Hits a, oh, no, big bomb. That's never good. But he's okay, and he's going to get that town hall. So there's that two-star right there. And the loons kill it. Last defensive down. And the king is going to go try and help out, but he's going to waste his time on walls while the air troops really do the damage here. Here they go, taking out the rest of the base. Really nicely done. Great job. Definitely want to see more of these three stars. If my clan needs any help, definitely ask these guys that you saw on screen. If you guys want to stop by my clan and talk to guys, feel free. It is King Spartans, and uh, we do request that you're over level 100 and you have high-level troops. But well done, 21 trophies. We are on a clan push. We are going for the top of the U.S. Let's see if we can get top 10. Um, that should be interesting enough. And then I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.